Come here real quick. Today's not a good day. Are y'all doing anything else throughout the week or something? I mean, next week? Next week. Okay, what, what day can I come in here? Um, get with me on Monday in my computer class. I got a few too many certifications. It's dangerous to do that in education. <laughs> Arts slash technology teacher okay. <laughs> slash finance teacher. I came from the business world where that was a good thing and this world is a little... Right? <laughs> get you in trouble. My skills were probably more on the financial, the organization, the front of the house side was where I worked. But I ended up married to a chef. My husband actually taught for five years and he started a program in Angleton and he grew it where he was doing the culinary classes and I was doing the intro to the culinary classes. Okay, we're gonna be doing our Friday prep for a competition. So everybody's gonna be doing something a little bit different today. Delilah's gonna be up on her cake. Fernando's gonna be over here chopping. John and Logan, pat shoe, piping. So focus on the temp of your dough. Make sure you're taking the temp because they're gonna be looking for that at competition. Giselle, pie dough, we're gonna get this down. The school I came from um, was twice as big and there was probably a whole lot more discipline problems and a little bit rougher. The principal, when he was hiring me, um, actually knew my school that I came from. And when we were interviewing, he knew that if I survived where I came from, that this would be nothing for me. Richard and Anthony, we're gonna be doing our customer service. I've got your menus over there, so pick. <laughs> we're gonna represent Houston today. Um, okay, everybody's got a hat, hairnet on. Questions? No rumors? No. Okay, all right, go to it. <laughs> um, let's go back and look in the refrigerator and see what we have. There is a stigma, and I heard it before I started working here, and people mentioned it to me, and I did have some concerns and when, before I walked in the first day, I was wondering, is this gonna be worse than when I came from? And I have never seen any of that. My first day, and I tell my students this, my first day I walked in and I was shocked because they would walk out and they would say, have a good day, Mrs. Daniels, and they were respectful and polite. I have been trying to help overcome that stigma. I feel like, the stigma is well we get we get the stigma that we don't really have much here we're not the best because we don't we're not the best at sports or anything like that so we are taken for granted just because of our location and the funds and our you know scores and games and everything which i think is kind of sad cuz lakeview's always been known as the poor school the unattractive school that everybody wants to go to Central. Kind of on the low income side of everything, um, not really maybe getting so many of the other programs that a lot of other schools do. You know, they, they've, they've heard it their whole lives, they felt it. Being kind of the, the stepchild of San Angelo, uh, Lakeview's never gotten the publicity, the focus, uh, like San Angelo Central. So for this program to come here and the kids to be so excited about it, that, that's what's really encouraging. We're actually doing stuff from our heart that we love in the kitchen and it's just amazing that two people brought this together. Yeah. Like I get super excited because cooking is something that I've never really had a chance to do on my own until this happened. Like I'm so grateful for that because I would never discover this if Miss Daniels and Chef didn't put up a fight.